Hi, it's Deborah from Beacon of Light, and today is Friday, February 23rd. Let's see what today's energy is going to be all about. We have a full moon in Virgo happening tomorrow on Saturday, uh, and I'll try and do a video for that energy uh, sometime today or tomorrow. Okay, let's see what's happening with that Virgo energy. Let's see what today's energy is leading into tomorrow. <laughs> like this one wants to come out. It's been a tough week. But I hope you guys are getting through this. I hope that you're finding the optimism and I hope you're finding the blessings in disguise as they appear. Okay, first card is the Eight of Cups walking away. And there's that big full moon right there. Look at that. Wow. Yes, we're staring at that full moon right in the face right now. It is very evident that there is something changing within us. It's changing, and so, it, it, so it's as it goes, as within, so without. So the changes that are happening within us, we're letting go of behaviors, patterns, um, feel uh, old rust i say old rusted energy <laughs> and it is rusty let me tell you because it hurts and it's stuck and it's hard to move so there's this rusted energy that's coming up and releasing right now and it this full moon is helping us get rid of that oop helping us get rid of that so let's see what we got here justice trying to find balance in our life in balance of all this energy, trying to find some sort of peace and inner inner peace, inner knowing that and trusting our wisdom and our knowledge to this process. Oh wow, ten of cups only to bring us into more abundance in the future, more complete harmony with ourselves. You know, this this rainbow here is opening up, it's this whole process is opening up our chakras to bring us more in alignment with a happy um, version of ourselves, the best version of ourselves. So that this, th this message is trying to let us know that even though things might be very difficult right now, uh, there is a purpose for this, I'm telling you. And we just have to keep squeezing through this birth canal so that we can get through this time and then have it be illuminated in the future and be and feeling almost when, when we do have this illumination it, it in, this, in this push through this difficult squeezing time it's going to feel so much better we'll be like oh my gosh we survived this we went through this 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 energy that is just squeezing some more out of us. It's like, when is this going to end? And there is, there is an ending. There is a pot of gold at the end of this rainbow. And it's purposely pushing through our chakras right now. This energy is purposely upheavaling anything that's stuck, anything that needs to come into light. And this Virgo full moon, full moon, Virgo energy is all about mother nature and the earth energy and sometimes when mother nature is um at the peak of her moment she erupts so we have volcanoes where something just needs to burst out and come up to be seen to be visible to show that there is something deep inside that needs to be uncovered to to be released and that is what's happening i kind of feel like there's a volcano erupting and just there, there's uh, going to be a an outcome that we don't know we don't don't know how to interpret yet because we just have never gone through this experience uh, in, in a way that is comfortable. So this uncomfortable time is continuing to push us through this energy. So. You can compare it to a birth canal just getting squeezed to death or a volcano just burning up on the inside ready to erupt but either way it's pushing something up out of us so that no longer limits us so it no longer creates fear inside of us 
So we have the courage and we have the confidence to keep moving forward, to know that we can get through anything that comes our way. All right, everybody, I hope this message finds you well and I will talk to you soon. Take care, bye.